Far removed from the bright lights of Cannes, the students from a largely Shiite university in northeastern Baghdad recently held their own film festival. The crowds had fun cheering for their fellow student actors. But the violence outside the theater was never far from the screen. Most of the films are about the Iraqi people and their joy, sadness and suffering, their daily suffering in this situation. This was reflected in the students' films because students are more sensitive than anyone else in this society. One student's film was inspired by a 2007 bombing at Munstan Saria University that killed more than 70 people. In another short film, the audience cheered as the Iraqi army shot an insurgent. The graduating seniors said they hoped to make movies that would inspire Iraqis. Honestly, regarding the current situation, we will try to make a movie that will improve things. To urge the people to quit terrorism, we will try to reach out to the developed countries. Everything in their life is good. For example, their children are living good lives, but here the children are suffering and in need of everything. I asked Arian Mohammed what he wanted to do after graduation. My ambition as a young Iraqi man is to be far away from killings and wars. I have had enough killing, enough war. We are trying to explain to the world that we had had enough of that. We have to leave this dark image behind. In a ceremony inside the Green Zone, prizes, some shaped like Hollywood's Oscars, were handed out to the graduating seniors for Best Screenplay, Best Director, and Best Film. One of the highlights of the festival was a short computer-animated film of a young Iraqi woman who dreams of escaping from prison. When the screenings were over, Ari and Iraq had celebrated their awards for first and third place. Thank you. Shukran jazilan. Arian said he hoped he could find work in Hollywood. Thank you. Thank you.